Alright, this is a really quick video I wanted to make to show you how to use the activity monitor or activity tracker feature of uh, Google Suite documents such as Sheets and um, Google Docs um, and how to use it to track student engagement with files that you might have shared with them and also respond to um, students who are shared on files. So this file here is a Google Sheets file that hopefully at least some of you have seen. This is the calendar I, template I put together for this year um, that's editable. You can edit it, all that stuff. Here's just the meta information up here. But what I'm drawing your attention to is up here in the right corner. First off, if you haven't seen, sharing files. When you share a file with somebody, you can set it so that um, they get an announcement when you share it with them and they can edit it. They can just view it without changing anything. They can leave comments but not change anything else. Um, so all that is available there. This document I shared uh, with Nate early on just to get the admin's feedback. But what I'm showing is right next to it here, this ziggity zaggity line, which is the activity dashboard um, that shows First off, it, there's two tabs on it, the shared with tab and the all viewers tab. So this file is shared with Nate, so it shows, him up, it shows it up here. But notice how it shows the last time he viewed this file. So I can see right away, oh, if he looked at it on Thursday, that's great, but I made changes this morning, so he probably should look at it again to double check that. Maybe I want to email him to let him know Hey, I made some changes. Blah, blah, blah. All right. And you can send a copy to yourself. But if you just have a file put out there for people to interact with, even if they're not uh, like a direct editor of it, this other tab here shows everybody who may have viewed a file and when they did. So in this case, let's go... Uh, old to new, so Nate was the first person to look at it, and then Benny jumped on the ball here to check out this file. So you can see right away, so say you have a file like this you shared with students, like, you know, a, a agenda or something, you can see if students have interacted with it, and if they haven't, you, can, you can't contact them, email them directly through this window, but you can maybe email them through Google to be like, hey, I see you haven't even looked at my agenda for today, what gives? Some other features over here are kind of nifty. Viewer trend, it doesn't break it down into individual users, but you can show over time when people really looked at a page and if that's petered off over time. So is what you might see is students may not look at a page when you first post it, but then right before the due date, oh, suddenly viewership will, will turn up. And then you can have things like sharing history, change settings, all that you can dig into. But I think these two features of looking at viewers that have seen it and when, um, if you have a file shared with a specific student or um, a colleague and you can email them directly from this file as you work on documents, uh, that's a really useful feature.